And I've only ever talked about things I feel comfortable talking about. I mean, like, when I was younger, I hated talking about the bullying situation at school. I didn't like talking why about my dad, uh, because obviously, at the time, it was a sensitive subject. But, I mean, it's it's one of those things that, well, in an ideal world, I wouldn't be doing this video, uh, because it shouldn't matter. Um, but recently, I was misquoted in an interview, and it made me feel really angry and frustrated. And, you know, like emotions that I've never felt before um, when reading something about myself. And for me, honesty is something that I really do believe in. And I've always been honest. I may have been you know, vague in some of my answers, but I've always been honest. And one thing I've never really felt that comfortable talking about um, are my relationships. Because that's what I get asked, even if I'm doing sporting interviews, is do you have a girlfriend, who are you seeing, all that kind of stuff. And I mean, I've been dating girls and um, I've never really had a serious relationship to talk about. Um, and now I kind of feel ready to talk about my relationships. And, you know, come spring this year, <laughs> my life changed massively when I met someone and they make me feel so happy, so safe and everything just feels great. And well, that someone is a guy. And it did take me by surprise a little bit. Um, I mean, it was always in the back of my head that something like that could happen, but it wasn't until spring this year that something just clicked it felt right and I was like oh okay and like I said my whole world just changed right there and then and you know and of course I still fancy girls but I mean right now I'm dating a guy and I couldn't be happier it feels safe and it just it just really does feel right and people are going to have their own opinions and I think people are going to make a big deal of this. I mean, is it a big deal? Well, I don't think so. And people will call me a liar. People, I mean, it's going to be, you know, big. But I wanted to say something and I feel like now I'm, I'm ready and I wanted to do it. And people will think, well, what, what will your dad say or what would your dad would have said? I mean... He always said to me, as long as you're happy, I'm happy. And right now, I couldn't be happier. My mum's been so supportive as well. I mean, I can count the number of people I've told on my, on my hand. But all my friends and family that I've told have been like, so supportive, which has been great. Um, but I told the rest of my family today. And, well, let's just say they had mixed opinions. Um, lots of them... Well, didn't believe it. Lots of them wanted me to keep it quiet. Some said, why don't you just do a statement? Why don't you just do, why don't you do a magazine cover? Why don't you do a TV interview? But, I mean, I didn't want like to get my words twisted. I wanted to put an end to all the rumours, the speculation, and just say it and just tell you guys. Because, you know, that's what I want to do.